please hit the subscribe button and click that notification bell to keep up to date with our latest videos. Hi, welcome back to our video tutorials uh, about useful calibration tools. Uh, today we're going to talk about the triple point of water, a very useful calibration constant that will allow you peace of mind actually uh, in using your calibration instruments. The ITS 90, which is the current temperature scale, defines the triple point of water at 0.01 degrees centigrade. So when you purchase a calibrated thermometer or send it for recalibration, you receive a certificate from your vendor and the critical value on that certificate will be the resistance at the triple point of water. The calibration lab will have tested it, put a value somewhere in the region of 100 ohms or 25 ohms if it's a 25 ohm PRT. So here's an example of a calibration certificate showing a resistance at the triple point of water, an or TPW value with a resistance in ohms. So from the calibration cert, we've seen what the original resistance at the triple point of water was. And now we want to ensure that this thermometer is good to use in the field for calibrations. When we come in in the morning, we have a triple point of water cell. And what we're going to do is we're going to create that with an uncertainty of 0.0002 of a degree centigrade within 20 minutes and check that the resistance at the triple point of water is still the same. The thermometer is good to use. So what we're going to do is we're going to put the cell into our maintenance apparatus. We just lower it down and we set it off to super freeze using the advanced features. And we wait 20 minutes. So the maintenance apparatus has frozen the liquid to minus 5 degrees centigrade. You can see it is still liquid because it needs a little bit of energy. And now it's frozen with liquid and ice and vapor. So we've created the triple point of water within the cell defined by the ITS 90 as 0 0.01 degrees C. We put it back in and now we're going to test all our thermometers to ensure they are accurate. So we've placed this uh, readout and probe into the triple point of water and all we have to do is take the reading 0.017 and now we know that this thermometer has a accuracy currently of 0 0.007 degrees C and we can compare the resistance reading also to its original calibration certificate. So now we can spend the day using this reference thermometer out in the field, carrying out good calibrations with the certain knowledge that that probe and readout are good and are within their specification.